<clears throat> where is Alpha waiting? We had said we were going to meet up on this map, and I feel like he's somewhere around here. Although I wouldn't be surprised if he was late as usual. Look at you. You're pathetic! Hmm? You're such a worthless coward. Out of the thousands of souls that died in that metro, you were the one who was lucky enough to make it to the surface. And here you are, squandering it. You've done nothing but manipulate everyone around you to save your own mind without the slightest clue of how to harm them. You know, maybe it'd be better if you were taken care of. Maybe it'd be better if you just withered away and died. Maybe it'd be better if someone usurped you and ended it all! Uh, Alpha? Oh, Jane, you're here! Are you ready to continue the Nuzlocke? Uh, I guess. Are you okay? What was that all about? Yes, yes, I'm fine. I was just in my head a little bit. Let's go ahead and get ready, okay? Alright. <coughs> oh, that nasty, nasty cop is back. <laughs> I'll get you a cup of water before we start. Don't worry, I've got you covered. You can count on me. Alright, uh, first match, let's go, let's go. Um, nice sprinkler right there, you can build if you're special and everything. Let's go ahead and push toward the Rainmaker. Let's nice sprinkle right there. Someone's already going nuts with their Super Chomp, I see, I see. Don't die those Super Chomps. I know you haven't seen those much, just don't get near them and you'll be fine. That's basically the best thing I can tell you. Uh, I don't- oh, I think the Wave Breaker got them. I was like, I have no clue what got them there, but we'll take whatever we can get. And I think that's just a- C- minus is filled with two different types of people. They're either people that are genuinely C- minus and trying out the game for the first time, or people who are on their scrim accounts. Judging by the fact that it's so slow to get C- minus games, I'm surprised there's that many people who are on their scrim accounts though. Match numero dos, we got an Aero Spray, we got a Splatana, we got two end zaps. You have more range than all of them, so just clock them all, zone them out, and make sure they can't get anywhere near you. I don't know what you threw right there, but that had like a good three seconds of life. <laughs> um, nice. We were trying to aim after the Rainmaker, but I guess we can take that guy too. That guy can just be like our collateral damage. Womp really wants us dead. Womp Womp really wants us to die, dude. Why did you hop in the middle of that? We could have taken care of him. God, okay, this guy's jumping off walls and everything, dude. Like I said, we got some prodigies in C-, man. Up here. I really don't know if... You would be able to do it. You were able to do it. Congrats. <laughs> they make it. Fantastic. That's two knockouts. I always say, like, man, we're running into so many hard C minus players. How dare they? Give me all the easy people. And then we proceed to do stuff like that. <laughs> okay. Match number three. Match number three. <clears throat> Is something wrong? No. Just go. Just go. Sorry. I had something in my throat. <clears throat> that was it. Aw, oh, dang it. We were just too late. I was like, we should probably worry about the people down there. Nice. And then there one guy left. Awesome job. You can go ahead and take that first checkpoint. Delicious, delicioso, delicioso. Oh! Uh, okay, kill that dynamo. There's one guy left. They're after you too. There we go. Nice, 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 nice. Bridge your way to victory. Get rid of that dynamo as well. There's one guy. It's the carbon. It's the carbon. That's not good. Okay. Never mind. It, everything is fine. Everything is fine. Rainmaker in the splat lock is so funny. Like, it either just is the most heartbreaking mode of all time, or... That happens. <laughs> <laughs> nice job. Match three done. The sooner we get off this map, the better. Are you sure you're doing well? Yes, I'm alright. I I promise. You've just been off all day, screaming at yourself in the middle of Scorch Gorge, sounding uneasy at the start of multiple matches, acting erratic. I said I'm alright! I'm sorry. <clears throat> just give me a couple of minutes and practice for your next match. Fine. As long as you stop sounding like you're about to cry in my ear at the start of each match. <clears throat> Let's just get this done. Okay, I'm a little nervous for this match. You know how our team last game was able to get a knockout in like a minute? Well, all of them are on the other team now, so we have to stop them from going ham on us. Oh, shoot. Just take care of them. Just take care of them, please. Thank you. Um, in the meantime, I think we'll just run to this first checkpoint. Uh, let's get up here and just run for our little merry life here. Oh, was this a good jump? Luckily it was. All of the nuclear fallout is here, but we are still able to survive. That charger's not letting anybody through here. Get out of there. Oh, I think their last two shots were enough to take care of everybody else. Let's just get a little bit closer. That probably was not the best idea, actually. We made us actually, like, a man down there, but we got them, like, very close to 12. The sucky thing is, this is Rainmaker, so it's still anybody's game. We can just wipe them out one more good time. We're chilling here. Please, please, just snipe them, y'all. Please. I'm trying to get to pick up as many as we can. That was not a good jump, my friend. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. 
No, that's not what I was looking for. No, that's so not good. That's so not good. What is this team? Dang it. There goes the splat lane. Like I said, these C minus teams kick butt, dude. Like, these C minus teams do not play around at all. You will get some crazy people that you are against. Ah, oh, man. We're up against that charger and those glugas again. Here's hoping for the best. Here's hoping this round is better than the last one. Those splatter shots were really just the nuts part last time. Are you serious? Okay, I was hoping. I'm like, please say one of those shots nails. <laughs> I would cry. Nice, okay. Good idea going for that lower checkpoint. I respect it, I respect it. Ooh, ooh, ooh. How are we still alive? I genuinely don't even know. Um, we take it to nine though. That's still not bad, still not bad. We lived for a lot longer than we should have there, <laughs> to be fair with you. Yo, there's two people. There's two of them? There's two right here. Oh my goodness. Goodbye. <laughs> I had a feeling you were gonna fall right down there with us. I was like, yeah, let me not deal with that right about now. Woo. That was a very weird Rainmaker shot, but all right. Nice, all right. When in doubt, Splat Bombs help you out. Oh, if only we had like double bomb in action right now. That would be crazy. Please don't let him go for that checkpoint. Thank you. I was like, please. <laughs> we got two of them down right now. And two of us are down right now too. Just hold your position. Let's not all die at the last minute. You've got to be kidding me. We got it. We got it. <laughs> Jeez. These guys all died and they were about to get that last second push again. We were not about- I was not about to have two instances where they beat us in like the last few seconds. Not two, alright? Maybe one, but not two. And match number five. This one is for the series. If we win it at least. Hopefully we can. Uh, was that a Flingza? That is a Flingza. And that's an Elia right there that we need to deal with. Woo! My goodness. Look at all those guys we were able to get rid of. Nice, nice, nice. I was about to say look at all those chickens, but uh, it just didn't come out of my mouth. Okay, got them, got them. We're down to 30 at least. Both teams are past their checkpoint, which is good. Floosh is somewhere around here. I don't feel confident until this Floosh dies. Oh my god, what is this Floosh? This Floosh is pressing like at least a thousand buttons a minute, dude. It's insane. All right, take it. Just get us to 15. Get us to 15. You guys can finish the rest. Run for it. Run for it. Don't let that Floosh through. Let's just get back. Let's just get back. We had a good push, so let's not blow it. Let's not blow it here. I'm surprised I didn't blow them up. If that blaster just holds down the fort and takes care of that Spire Shot Jr., we should be good. Just don't get yourself killed, dude. Why would you do that? Why would you do that? I admire the spunk, but why, why would you do that? Why would you do anything like that? This guy actually presses like a thousand buttons a minute. <laughs> like, actually. This guy, I can imagine just if he had like a hand cam, if he was like a streamer. I just imagine just hearing... I just imagine that. Oh my god. We playing, Kane. We are playing. Five wins in a row. Um, sure. Let's say that. Let's say that. Nice. We got our rank up battle. Fantastic. Just barely squeaked our way through, but we were able to get it. All right. So we have lost our Splatling, but hopefully we can get something good in the place. But Splatling was a good one to have too. Splatling did us well too until just the last second where we got tripped up by an ink strike and then just lost it all. Oh well. Oh god. And we have to do all this. Sheldon, just go. All right, well, one thing that did catch my eye is we do now have the Tenetech splatter shot that we could possibly get. But the thing is, that is a one in a lot chance. Okay, Numa, give us a random number between one and 31. 17. What is the 17th weapon, Numa? <laughs> Your sense of humor is as cruel as ever. When I asked for a splatter shot, this isn't the one that I think we needed. Okay, let's get it, team. Ooh, we have no pushing power whatsoever. You couldn't have gave one of those dualies arrow spray to us, huh? All right, fine, fine. We make it work. Somebody right over there, I believe they still are. Hi there, dapple dualies. I see you here. Is he stuck? <laughs> are they still, like, legitimately, were they stuck there? Or were they just, like, playing us? We need to, like, constantly keep a lookout. Watch the left of you, watch the left of you. Or don't, uh, just run for your life. 17, not bad, not bad. Where are them dap- There are them dapples. There are them dapples. Are you gonna tactical lock yourself again? <laughs> I have never seen that before. I think- I don't even- Either that or they just didn't know they could squid form through it. Now what if we make a run for it? What if we make a run for it and get our first battle? I see the crack in there for reassurance. <laughs> 
Good you have Secret Service now, Kane. Yeah. Alright, I got a lot of Samurai players on that other team this time. <laughs> I see, I see. Be careful down there. Come on, come on, come on. Just hold forward. Just hold forward. Wherever you want to go. Wherever you want to go. Just hold forward. We'll stop this guy from moving forward. You hold forward, but they can't. It is up to you guys if you want to go anywhere with that. Woo! I don't know how we were able to get out of that, but we take it. We don't, again, don't ask questions. Just count your blessings. You're trying a lot of stuff and none of it worked. <laughs> I respect the effort, though. I respect the moxie. Watch out. We got a new squiffer on the loose. We got a new squiffer. Ah, yep. I think they missed their second or third shot, and then just said, you know what? Screw it. And they just collided with us. Just kamikaze with us. We just gotta be ready. These guys are gonna... Oh, that is so... Who knows to do that? Oh, my... <laughs> be rank. Oh, my gosh. Look behind you, you fool. Look behind you. Why is nobody with him? Uh... Well, Nova... I, right when I was saying we were gonna have you to the finish, uh, we don't have you to the finish. Goodbye. Man, everything we try to do fails us in the end. Why do we even try? Hey, Kane, how do you remain calm during all of this? Hmm? What do you mean? I mean, you lost two weapons before even getting to the B ranks, and it's likely gonna get even harder from here. Well, it is unfortunate, but I take this as a learning experience. I better understand why I should and shouldn't do in a rank like this. I would still be super upset over something like that happening, though. It's not like there's anything at stake with this Nuzlocke. If I lose, then I'll just try again until I win. But it would look cooler to others if you did it the first time. <laughs> now you're just being prideful. I try not to let my ego affect my decisions. If you keep your head down and work until you're satisfied instead of constantly looking toward others for gratification, you'll save yourself a lot of mental anguish. It's nice to do things well the first time, but when you struggle to do something, that makes you appreciate it all the more when you finally do it right. Huh, so struggling can have some upsides in the long run. I'll have to keep that in mind. Alright, back to good old Junior. Why do we keep going here? Oh god, oh god, are these guys just gonna- Okay, I at least, we are at least able to stop him there, we're at least able to stop him there. What the heck are these teams? We got him down to the last person, which is good. Right now it's just Dreadringer left. Okay, the bomb took care of him. Awesome job, awesome. Thank you. Alright, awesome job. Here we go, got rid of one of them, that's good. Got rid of that guy too, fantastic. That should have possibly killed the Luna, but okay. <laughs> I thought the bomb would have taken care of the Luna, but it did not. You're dead. You're gone. Come on, let's move, let's move, let's move. Let's move forward. There we go, there we go. Let's Rainmaker them back. Let's Rainmaker them back. Awesome. <laughs> Jeez. I thought, I feel like we're playing an S rank right now. But this is B. What is A like? For any of you who are like genuinely new to the Splatlands and everything, if you get matched with players like this, I'm sorry. And one more on Flounder. Let's a go. Let's a go. I actually don't know. Do we lose a game on Hammerhead? I'm actually not sure. I know we've lost a couple on this one with the same loadout and everything. Um, if you want. I think this is just too far though. I was saying, like, if you want, you can just hop off here if you like. Or go here. This is fine too. Woo! <laughs> Kane, you walked so he could run. <laughs> and you got crushed so he could run too. Thank you, come again. Thank you, come again. Get out of here. And then we'll take this before. <gasps> oh, we were playing a game of Pac Man right there. We take it. We take it. Get me out of Get us out of these C ranks right now. Get us out of these C ranks, dude. Oh my gosh. And just like that, we make it to the B ranks, baby. Just like that, we make it to the B ranks. Because we did do a rank of battle, I'm also counting the rank of battle series as series because, you know, it's still, you gotta win three games. It's still a decent amount. And I think we need one at this point, too. So, Numa, give us a number between 1 and 34. 1 and 34. I knew that we were eventually gonna get a charger. I wish it wasn't this soon, but you know what? It's Squiffers. So, you know, it's better than like E Leader or something like that. Where we can throw out a million shots and at least one of them will hit. Thank you so much, Kane. I appreciate you taking this off my mind. We had a couple very tense games. So, a mixture of those tense games and the lax ones that we did have where you were still able to win and everything, you definitely took a lot of stuff off my mind. I think finally, for the first time in a little while, with that off my mind, I can get just a little bit of peace and quiet. <laughs> Kane, you're here too? We were just in Splatsville. Yeah, I don't know what's going on either. <gasps> Billy's here too. And the host of the expedition is here as well. Uh, I was just with Bartholomew a moment ago. A and I was working on the next expedition. I didn't do anything to bring them together like this. What is going on here? Oh goody, you're all here. I hate to intrude on all your busy schedules, but I have some important secrets that I've just been itching to share. <gasps> no! Tricks won't work on me. <laughs> what? 
What did you do to him? Nothing he hasn't already brought upon himself. You see, there's some things that your beloved brother hasn't been sharing with you. Do you know how I was able to bring you all here to have this little chat? It's because we're all more connected than you think, you know. Each one of us has a part of Alpha's life force, his very soul coursing through our bodies. His kindness, his pride, his diligence, his wrath. Each of us is born from a fragment of his soul and he uses these fragments to try and control all of us. What? You're lying. Alpha would never do something like that to the three of us. I... I trust him. Okay, then. Do you have any other idea where you came from or do all of your lives stem from you mysteriously arising from a random ink puddle on a corner of a map and then being conveniently drawn toward Alpha? While you were on Alterna, you even bore witness to the tug and pull between you and Alpha's lives. At every point when you were emotionally scarred, Alpha was coincidentally faced with sudden debilitating headaches. And I know you always felt that there was a deeper reason behind it. That still does not make any logical sense. Shedding parts of your soul to create another person and using that to manipulate them? Why that that's just impossible. You say as you were the closest to discovering how it is possible. That statue on Hammerhead Bridge held the physical ingredient needed to create us, and it was designed to create the perfect life form. When mixed with certain pieces of Alpha's soul, it created life that could feel, think, or work on an unfathomable level. That is the reason behind your suspiciously gifted intelligence. Uh, what? Your co-workers have known this for months, but they couldn't tell you since you shot them with a poison that threatened to kill them every time they tried. No, I didn't! Yes, you you did? Or do you have a conveniently large hole in your memory from the first time they attempted to show you something on Bluefin? You pulled the trigger, but your brother was the real culprit. Ask them about it if you think I'm tricking you. He used the part of his soul within you to possess you and poison them before they could reveal who you truly are. He probably did all of this for a reason. No one does something like that for that long without a cause. Oh, there's a cause! It's to use you. Since you first arrived in the Splatlands, you were called upon to do another Nuzlocke before anything else. All you were designed to be are tools, too controlled to learn about yourselves, and only meant to enrich the life of your creator. Drag through your series until it ends and cast aside when it's all over. At the end of the day, all of you are clones. No, you're slaves. <laughs>